Greeting intrepid spacefarers, prepare to unlock the cosmic mastery of pharmaceuticals as we embark on a stellar journey through over 60 mind-bending tips and tricks and secret stats. This isn't your ordinary guide, it's a pharmaceutical odyssey in the vast universe of Starfield. From their powerful effects to where you can secure these coveting concoctions, we're leaving no star unturned in this quest for pharmaceutical mastery. Whether you're charting your course amongst the cosmos or just dipping your toes in the cosmic current, this guide is your ultimate companion. But hey, this isn't a one-way journey. Join the cosmic conversation by smashing that subscribe button and dropping your thoughts in the comments below. Your insights power these warp drives, so let's make this exploration an epic odyssey. Buckle up, spacefarers, because the pharmaceutical secrets of Starfield await, and the adventure starts now. All right, these are going to go fast, but I'm going to show you everything that I carry in a combat situation. First off, we have AMP. This gives you 35% movement speed, as well as you're able to jump twice as high for two minutes. We have Battle Stim. This is going to give you 250% damage resistance for five minutes. These both can be found at Doctor's Trade Authority, Red Mile, you can craft them, or any general store. We have Bayou's Private Reserve next up. This is going to give you 12% Persuasion, as well as 20% O2 for 10 minutes. You need to make your way to the Astro Lounge and come talk to this guy so that you can buy Bayou's Private Reserve. It is a rare cognac, possibly of old earth origin, kept in a crystal vessel for decanting. It costs 848 credits to get it, but if you need to do persuasion, I believe this is the highest one out there. Next up, we are going to go with Blend. This is an alternative for Aurora. It slows time by 16% for 10 seconds, gives you 60% damage resistance for 3 minutes, as well as 20% O2 recovery for that same time. To get it, we need to be on Neon. We're going to Legrand Liquors. You can buy them, but I'm just going to sit down here and I'm going to steal them because why spend money when you don't have to? I like free. If it's free, it's for me. Blend is a carbonated alcoholic beverage blended with caffeine and a potent secret ingredient. That secret ingredient is going to be Aurora. How, how do I know this? Is because you come to this guy and you do a mission and he sends you to go and make Aurora. And by doing that, it gives you the ability to craft Aurora if you're not familiar. Next up, we have Bodakai. This is going to give you O2 and damage resistance for three minutes. Next up, we have Chimera. This is going to give you 8% Persuasion, 40% Damage Resistance, and 15% O2 Recovery for 3 minutes. To get this, we're going to go to Euphorica. We are going to go upstairs, but you can't talk to this bartender here. The reason why I go upstairs is because I paid to see if I could get Aurora cheaper. It is not. It is the same price. So we are going to talk to this guy right now, and we are going to buy ourselves some Chimera. Every time I, I say Chimera, I think of... Uh, what is that? Full Metal Alchemist? Oh, that, that was the worst episode. Oh, man, I was so... But whatever, let's get into this. We got Chimera. It is a canned cocktail of three different liquors. And like I said, it gives you a smorgasbord of goodies. So make sure you pick them up and use Chimera. CBX, I'm melee. So this gives me 25% melee damage for five minutes. So anytime I want to use my shiny sword and start going around decapitating, I make sure I take a CBX. Emergency kit that gives you health and these could all be found at general stores red mile Reliant and all that good stuff. You're a brew light can and you're a brew pills can do not spend money on this because they are absolutely everywhere Let's go get it. It is super simple. You steal a ship you attack a ship you go into the cargo bay and there is stockpiles of these I have hundreds of you're a brew so Don't spend your money Frost Wolf. This is going to give you 40% damage as well as additional benefits. Hippo. Yeah, whatever. This alpha is going to give you range. So if you're doing that range stuff, make sure you go and get it. And as always, it's found at the general stores. Jake Stout gives you 60% damage resistant and 10% O2 recovery for three minutes. Junk Flush will cure any addiction, so if you start taking Aurora and you gotta kick the bucket, go ahead and take that. 
We got Neurogenic. This is going to give you better research and a better chance for research for 10 minutes. Pansia, this is going to treat any affliction, broken legs, broken bones, any of that stuff. Uh, I'm not even going to try and pronounce that, but this is for range damage, weapon accuracy, and movement. Next up, we have Paramore, not the band. This gives you 25% persuasion. Penicillin treats all inflictions, just like it would in modern society. Potatoes, make sure you pick them up for the great potato famine. Uh, Reconnaissance, this is stealth. 30% movement noise reduced for 10 minutes. Next up, we have Red Trench. 40% melee damage, 300% damage resistance for 3 minutes. And all of this can be found at your general store, Red Mile, wherever you want to go. Runner's Rush gives you 16% movement speed, 40% damage resistance, and 20% O2 recovery for 3 minutes. This is found at the Red Mile on Porima. And all you got to do is come up and talk to the bartender and buy yourself some runner's rush for 147 credits a piece. There isn't a combat situation where I do not take runner's rush. Ship parts is how you heal your ship. They're extremely heavy, so do not carry them around. I have one so that I could show you and that's it. Squall, 20% damage, 20% movement for 2 minutes. Supernova gives you 9% persuasion, 10% O2, and 25% O2 recovery for 5 minutes. To get it, you gotta come to the viewpoint on New Atlantis and speak to this chica. And speaking to her will give you the ability to buy Supernova. She will have a side mission as well if that's something you are interested in. A liqueur slush floated over a sour punch of exotic alien fruits. I don't know about you guys, but that sounds delicious to me. This is Viewpoint Original. It's a twist on a screwdriver and alien fruit, but it doesn't have the best of stats in my opinion, so I, I, I normally don't buy it. Next up, we are going to go to the Synapse Alpha. This is going to be research top shelf. 80% damage resistance, 6% carrying capacity, and 25% O2 recovery. Anytime I'm in New Atlantis in the commercial district, I come to Whetstone, speak to this lady, and I buy myself a top shelf. It is a vodka, gin, and rum cocktail with a splash of sour and cola. I don't know if that sounds good, but I mean, I'd be willing to give anything a try once. Trauma pack, that is how you heal. Velocity, yellow. This is going to give you 12% persuasion, 60% damage resistance, and 25% O2. To get it, you gotta be on Neon and come to Madame Savages. This lady right here in Madame Savages has this velocity yellow. There's also a bunch of different colors. They are all the same stats. So buy whichever one you, you want, or you can steal it, do what you do. Whiteout is 25% damage and 35% movement speed for two minutes. So if you wanna go zoom, zoom, Alien genetic material, 500% damage resistance, 500% energy resistance for 30 seconds. This can be found on any Terramorph. Next up, you are able to craft 90% of any of these pharmaceuticals that you are buying at a general store. You have to have a certain skill in the chemistry, I will show you, but on the screen, you're able to see 90% of what I just showed coming down, and it is relatively easy to make with these now make sure that you have the the proper synapse alpha and all of that stuff to lower the amount of materials and research that you actually need to be able to do this now let's say that you don't have the skill so what you need to do is come to the skills and it's chemistry over in the science i have rank two unlocked so Rank three and four will only give you more stuff to create. Here, I'm going to show you that if you do not have the stuff, you are able to track it so that you can go and get those specific. Tip number 39 bazillion, whatever it is in this one, they've gone fast. You take a photo in game and it becomes your screensaver, your loading screen. Each one of these I have taken um, you know, doing combat, flying around, whatever it is, it is going to show you your highlights in the pause screen if that's something you're interested in. 
Hidden all over the universe are secret stat books, such as Combat Tech, which will increase your range accuracy for Combat Tech weapons. There is going to be multiple of each book, and I will show you where these are located. Um, the information is going by fast on the screen, so if you do not catch what these are and where to get them, make sure you pause the video, you rewind, you do that thing. But I'm going to let you jam out to some tunes and learn about these books. As our interstellar journey through the cosmos of pharmaceutical wonders comes to a close, I want to extend my deepest gratitude for joining this epic adventure. But fear not fellow spacefarers, for the wealth of knowledge doesn't end here. If these tips and tricks in the cosmic guide flew by at warp speed, don't hesitate to hit pause, rewind, and soak in the gold mine of insight we've unearthed together. Your engagement and curiosity fuel our ongoing odyssey, so don't forget to smash that subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and drop your thoughts in the comments below. Stay tuned for more intergalactic wisdom and to continue your quest for Cosmic Alliance. Check out the playlist appearing on the screen. And until our next Cosmic Rendezvous, keep exploring, keep learning, and may your journey through the stars be filled with boundless discoveries. Until then, fellow spacefarers, stay tuned, stay interstellar, and I'll catch you on the next one. <laughs>